doing a lot of good work to look out for all of us. Because we all need it together. I do not know if rebellion is exactly a smart thing for a bunch of dark workers. While it was necessary, mm -hmm. I do not think it was smart. Alas, mm -hmm. you are all better now. Just don't mm -hmm. take unnecessary risks, kid. You're right, Ray. Show you my helmet. Well, you two have a good day. Good morning. Cool down a bit. Easy. But we'll see. We'll see where things go. Hmm. And actually, um, I'll be sitting out for the morning jog. If that's still happening. But if not, uh, how about that? How's you doing? Expecting something. Fuck. You look like you're expecting something. <sighs> well, we all are, aren't we? Yeah.
All it is right now is just the paranoia kicking in again. <clears throat> Only thing I can hope for is to stay as far back away from it as I possibly can. Have you got things set up? But who to knows leave what's gonna happen at the infirmary to. now? Are we planning that already? Just in case. Yeah. Glad a few people have put contingencies in place. Just have your things close All I'm by. hoping for is no more crazy shit at the infirmary. Soma, you know who's coming. And that, right now, is what I'm worried about the most. Ditto. Pray it's not one of our old friends. With our luck, probably. All of Nadis is dead before the Avenge could be served. Morning. Hey, hey, ooh. I'm gonna get your ass back here. <laughs> Sorry. Uh, I have many questions for you and the other one, but the main question. Um, Wanted to know if you guys have any idea of like who would be able to make like just some crude spears around town. I don't know if that's something you guys do or <clears throat> we can do it. We just don't really have the iron. Okay. You, you need it. Can you guys do like wooden ones or stone ones or anything? Not really in our warehouse. We're blacksmiths after all. We could check with a woodworker if they just have. Link oh. practice spears if that's what you want. Hey, if you want to join them. Yeah, I'm just looking for something basic to outfit a handful of people. Uh, basically, learn how. Well, <clears throat> you could get wooden halves from the woodworker, but that wouldn't do too well in an actual fight. But it would be good for training if that's something okay. that you're looking to do. We can also make actual spears, but we need okay. the, the iron for it. Until then, we can't really help Can much. you guys make hobbit side spears? Yeah, I mean, we just do the uh, the spearhead bit. The haft is up to the uh, woodworker. Oh. There. Who is the woodworker? Uh, Marcus. Is Marcus no. still doing that? Yeah. Okay, okay. I'll talk with him, then. Um, if we're looking to get, like, an iron spear thing how what would that cost resource wise or coin wise hmm. it'd be two iron ingots and it would cost about five six silver to make that's not if you bring us the supplies though yes if you bring us the supplies we could easily make it cheaper <clears throat> okay. That's painful. Yeah. Right, thank you. Appreciate it. Of course. Yeah. yeah. Got to do that times 15. <sighs> Maybe we could work a bulk out. order deal out or something like that. Yeah. I'm assuming iron, much like most resources, would be the biggest issue. Yeah. Yeah. You would need 30 iron ingots, yeah. which is a lot. Yeah. All right. Well, thank you. Of course. Appreciate it. I'll leave you too. Thank you. 
I always do that. Mm -hmm. like we have some secret meeting we need to go <clears throat> to. Do we need to have a secret meeting? Mm. You've been out and about. I don't think so. Okay. No, actually, I was... Um, in my room for most of the time. Just needed to process things on my own time. Go. Sure. You ever want to talk? Did I miss anything? Huh. Um. <clears throat> Sif's funeral. We, uh, um, I was there. You were? Huh. Oh, were you? Yes. That's right, you were, and then you I went to sleep. I left early. Fucking hell, I am so mm. out of it. Um, then, no. It's alright. <laughs> Not really. Oh, um... Tazim and I are lords now. Technically. <laughs> well, that's something. Yeah, we're kind of downplaying it, though, because we haven't really done anything to... You know, throw it all about. We're not putting much weight behind it right now. And considering who's showing up today, probably best to keep it low key. <clears throat> Is it time then? They're scheduled to arrive today, so unless they got some delays. I don't know what that means for well, a lot of people, so I know you travel light, but keep a go bag nearby in case shit hits the fan and you need to skedaddle. I'll find you first. Not going off by myself again. <laughs> Alright. Good luck at the forge, unless you want me to sit in a corner somewhere. <laughs> but I don't want to get in. What the fuck is that? Hmm? Nothing, I'm fixing something. <clears throat> I think I was hallucinating. Yeah. Someone was wearing something they shouldn't have been. Yeah. <laughs> uh, I'm actually about to go for a run if you want to join me. If you got other things, I understand. Nope, not really. You haven't seen my... Oh, fuck, Soma and um, Basil got married. Well, they got engaged. That's something. What? Yeah. You are so bad at telling me what happened. I look it in my head. It's been like a week, so. <laughs> no, there was a <clears throat> there was a party for Basil. It was like her birthday or near enough to it, and apparently, um, Soma proposed. So. Well, that's cute. Let's hope it lasts. What else? Um, <clears throat> not much. Torty and I had drow time, I guess. That's good. I suppose. I hope I've given her some direction to things. She seems a little lost, you know? In what way? <laughs> Asking me questions like, do you know who you are? Was she drunk? No more than usual. <laughs> I think she's just... Well, it occurred to me while I was talking to her that while we've been dealing with the shit that we've been dealing with over the course of, what, three and a half, four years coming up to, it's all been dumped on her in the last month or so. Someone who's never really spent much time on land to begin with. So this is... A lot for her, I believe. It's got to be a bit she's of a so culture young. shock. She is. She's tiny. Can you hear that when I talk in my head? How loud the rain is? Only when you point it out. Yeah. <laughs> 
Oh. That's rain? <laughs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> You've got the power of God and the thunder on you. <laughs> okay, here we go. <laughs> Don't forget to take your hood off. There you go. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. What? You can stop there. <laughs> Go. Blair. <laughs> Shoes too? No, I'm putting the weights on. <laughs> oh. <clears throat> Didn't know you had weights. Interesting. I guess you did. I am the storm that is approaching. So loud, I can't hear shit. <laughs> oh no. <clears throat> but it's good that you're getting rain, right? Yeah. It hasn't rained for a week or two. But, I mean, we're just coming out of winter, so it's to be expected. Yeah. I fucking hate running on sand. Ugh. That's why I stay close to the water's edge, it's a little harder there. everything up because I can't hear shit. <clears throat> <laughs> Do you, uh, have a plan for these imps? Keep my head down. Smart. Got the plan lay out, I guess. Walk around with my crossbow pretty much loaded. Just need to knock the bolt. Mm-hmm. Harry is working on a scheme to try and get as many civilians out of the town as possible before the robber baron actually starts to begin his proper attack. So in the next coming days there's going to be a caravan of civilians if you're interested in doing some work. I don't know if you get paid, but... <clears throat> I do need coin. If it doesn't interrupt any plans that I have. Did you get paid the uh, 30 silver to deal with the Capitano? No. I okay, did not. well, you would have 30 silver for dealing with the Capitano. Everyone who was there oh. got it. <clears throat> I'm fucking loaded now. Right. <laughs> now I can pay you to fix this fucking dagger I found. That I've just been holding. <laughs> Is it that like anyway. fancy one? Sure it's steel. Mm. I um have a few ingots lying around. I could repair it if you'd want. I just don't tell if it to the general it's people. For something more important. No, I'm just hanging on mm. to it just in case. But well, rather smoke it while we got it, so to speak. <clears throat> It would help. It would replace the <laughs> the one I have now is about to fall apart. It's iron. I've had it for two years now. Let me think. <laughs> yeah, I have enough. I can do it. <laughs> That's if it's made of steel. I haven't <coughs> gotten it um, looked at yet. I would assume so. It's that fancy fucking drow one, right? They wouldn't be so wet over a fucking iron dagger, surely. I don't know if it's... Well, that one that I showed you, that is not for fighting. Ah, I see. That's it's a different one, minds. then. For swaying minds. It is a symbol. Hmm. 
Yes, if I showed uh, that to the right person, I could save myself or someone else. For a very or brief second out. there, I thought you meant it was magical. Oh, fuck no. I would not be walking around. I was going to say, me. yes. Absolutely not. And if I did, and if you were my only option to get it looked at, I would be honest <laughs> with you. So you could say no. <laughs> well, thank you. Oh, um... <sighs> Cade and Quinn came by the forge and asked Tazim and myself to take off her fucking shackles that are around her neck. Which we did. I didn't get so much as a fucking thank you. Huh. <laughs> don't know how to feel about that situation. It churns me up inside. It's a strange one. Neither Tazim nor I really wanted to do it, but we did it for Shieldbrook. That's good. He's been through a lot. Haven't we all? Hmm. Good news. Better. Getting a full night's sleep That's and everything. Good. Benoit should be in town. Have to look over my shoulders as much. Would love to Friends with that kit, right? Say again? Your friends with the kit, right? The Hobbit. Kit. Little Hobbit wears purple. Mm, maybe. Hmm. I do like the Hobbits, some of them. I miss Bovo. He was the best Hobbit. I mean, he's not so bad. Oh, you know what? Maybe I'm getting you confused with her me. Wow, we <laughs> fucking summoned one. Yeah, I was watching him pass. It was, like, interesting. They know. Well, it sounds like Hopper's trying to uh, make a Hobbit militia, at least, so... <laughs> if he's asking for 15 spears in the size of Hobbits... 15. So holy like a fuck... What? What happened? The, 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 my, my head <laughs> is rumbling. Oh... Oh, would you look at that? Hmm. That's, not, that's not a shadow to see every day. Why well, the concerns are still valid. Walking around with, with a guard. Uh, if Roma to do it's a new issue every day. Good lord. Really? So there is. We'll speak inside. Apparently he's got a fancy title. Good morning to you both. Morning. Need me for something? Do you wish to oh, come inside? Yeah. Something. Do I get to come? We're doing peasants work? An arm armory? Some that kind of thing? You shouldn't be That's asking amazing. that. I'm like three times your own. Let's go inside. I think most would consider that like What the fuck? Wait, no. I'm wait, no. I'm three times your age, old man. He 
it turns into a sailor, actually. Don't act like I've changed. I've said shit like this since the beginning. Maybe I blocked it out. For good reason. Maybe, maybe you memorized it and cherish it. <laughs> oh, fuck me. I snort a lot. What the fuck was that? Oh, Problems. small records that the custode has yeah. bestowed upon me, and now the good lord must preside over. The there good are lord. some <gasps> outstanding measures, however. Do tell. Sergeant Stefano has seen fit and has understood that not all of the Capitano's men have been taken care of. We have missing persons reports, and we have whispers that some of the loyalists are still alive. To the think they're hiding amongst the ranks of the Custodes men? Of course they would be. We've been... I've been searching. And we have a few leads, but nothing concrete. Well, the two others in this room are going to be your best bet to any sniffing out of people like that. Mm. If it becomes internal and requires a more finessed hand with paperwork, Markle is the man you want to go to. I see. Very well. But information gathering or making someone disappear in the night. We can arrange that. However, Stefano and Fenton wish for a more legal approach. Raise your hand. You could say that. And then the Capitano. The Baron said the same. The... the only way that I think of it, Marco, is that the Capitano's men is the ones actually loyal to him. Are the ones that created this situation. People that were stuck in the middle guardsmen who also had families and loved ones that the Capitano could reach out and touch with a mace. Victims of circumstance. We can't hang everyone. Amnesty must be given where it can be. But men like Nariz must be found and executed. Stefano wishes to kill that man personally for what he's done. A lot well, of people you can do, Marco. Coerce him and otherwise... He's on our well, shit I can, list. I can tell you Nariz is in Black Rock, so getting your hands on him is out of the picture, I'm afraid. At least you're guardsmen. Perhaps we can figure something out in the near future. Perhaps. Now, with the reports well, from the Tower the Sentries... Of course. With the reports from the Tower Sentries that the Imperial ships are 20 minutes out, I assume the Barons... Intend to meet them up front. As is their custom. Especially last time when the Imperials showed their faces here. I would trust that the two good barons will hold their tongues of their uh, amnesty towards each other for this. I know one of them will. Still not much Let's I can do about that. Anything new about the back and forth with the robber baron up north? We've had a missing persons report. A mercenary by the nickname of Jerry. There have been concerns and some people have stated one Miss Laudia in fact stated that the man saw it very fit that all of the guard and others should get out as quickly as possible now I don't know if this was pertaining to the robber baron or the Imperials I'm not sure but this man wanted to skip town and as of yesterday he is still missing that doesn't make sense. He is the mercenary guild liaison. 
You wouldn't be embroiled in any of the conflict. You would be able to sit by and sit out of it. Why would he That's feel the need I to fight? Until I started questioning some of his closer friends. And other mercenaries. And? Apparently... Yes, speak. Go ahead. I saw, um... Mr. Cherry, a few days ago, before he disappeared. They sent us to tell or keep her a mem's request. Cherry was acting strange around a mem. Skittish, sweating, avoiding eye contact. Very unlike him. He's very outgoing. And that leads to the next piece of evidence or lead <sighs> Mr. Cherry was sent on what only the mercenaries could call as a black contract one he took with his friends a lead on the two that tried to assassinate the Baron after some time another contract was placed by some lady I did not get a full description of her, but a counter contract was placed on his group to remove them because they were harassing and torturing citizens. The rest is history, seeing how he was the only one and one other to come back from the contract. James, both this Cherry and Angus, correct? Correct. For a mercenary to flee like that in a conflict that doesn't pertain to him, either he's been contracted by one side and that side's losing, or he knew something. I'm willing to bet the latter. Find I out what you right. can. Why? I know this isn't going to leave this room, but... Please, just promise. We work, and I trust Marco. His real name is Elosrin. I haven't gotten around to figuring out where to look up what house he's of, but he is an elf from Eshmeth Elos, and he threatened me when I tried to ask him why he was acting so weird around a mem. He said, if I keep prying, there will be consequences. Not just for me, but for everyone around. So I let it go. You see if we can look into any of the custodian's records. Bring it to Sarah to look over. I will not have time. The Imperial <laughs> ships are about to land. In the next few minutes, I must return to the keep. <clears throat> what do we do? Put on your best smile. That's about it. The Barons will be coming down to meet with them. They'll be an official present. <sighs> well, this pray nothing goes wrong. Are we Both not sides. telling the God that we Hiding? Have no. to him? No what? Are we not telling them that we know what happened to Cherry? What happened to him? He left. That's what happened. Right? Marco, come back here. No, Sarah. My lord. Fill him in. I have to go. <clears throat> I'm sure she knows as well. Uh, either last night or the night before. Sanders was seen leaving ah, my Lord, speaking Nautus. Of he uh, was followed by so some of our own to a shack in the middle of nowhere. When they went in there, they Still found Mr. Cherry's body butchered uh, this, this in the basement. When they tried to leave, 
a group of ex-gods that identified themselves as Naraz's people set the son of a bitch set the, the uh, place on fire well, at least doused it in oil they were going to come back the next morning but we didn't follow up on it they mentioned that Naraz was in Blackrock at least they were heading there do you want so, me to wear your colors tomorrow? If you knew something that could have implicated Naraz. I will leave that up to you, sir. That man already has enough incubation. He was one of the Capitano's men. Why the colors purple and gold? He's done enough to earn him at least three, four life sentences, if not a hanging at most. Hmm. Hmm. But for him to target... Good morning, all of you. I'll be around. Good morning. To me, to for him to target this but, mercenary exclusively for some reason like this. He knew something that could dig a dagger inside. Okay. I'll give this information to the custode. Very good. I must go. Thank you for your time. You are right. I'm so tired of losing people before I can even get to know them. A friend of yours. Almost. Ah. I wasn't aware, I'm sorry. He was an elf. It's not personal, it's... <clears throat> you know how I feel about that. Yeah. I would have um, told you with more tact if I knew, though. I'm sorry, it was so blunt. It's... So, I... I, I think I knew it was going to happen. The moment he said he was leaving, I knew he was running from something. Turns out it was something he did. Well, a little bit of extra information, just between you and me. <clears throat> you remember the stories of how the previous Baron died? He went to meet with the Vapex with a mercenary company. This meeting went wrong, and he died, along with all of these mercenaries. Apparently not all of them died. Your acquaintance was one of the only people that made it back. So he knew what happened there. I don't know if that's related to him being um, <coughs> silenced, but... It would definitely put a target on his back. Definitely explains why he's so strange around the barons. Why he's so combative about the subject. He saw something. Hmm. He probably knows what happened to the baron. He claims he d he didn't. He's been close friends with um, Gerbum for a while. But when, every time Gerbum asks him about it, he claims that he didn't know who did it. It was a masked figure and the options were either join him or die, so. Masked figure. Hmm. Well. I guess we should go see the boats arrive. Assess the threat. <coughs> Stick close Thank to me. Thank you for telling me. Of course. Always. <laughs> This is not going to be You look fun. good, by the way. Oh, you like it? It's not too prissy <laughs> for you? Mm -hmm. No. I like the purple. Look closer. 
a very slight shimmer of a silvered line running around it. <gasps> Much of a spider web. Good, 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 mm -hmm. good, good, good. So, good. I'll be protected, right. at the very least. It looks good. This is what every drow should be wearing. Not this outfit, but, you know. <laughs> I was gonna say, I could not imagine many drow wearing this. Uh, yeah, I... Mm -mm. But on you, good. I'm built different. <laughs> The only downside is this one doesn't have a hood. Well, lords don't wear hoods. Exactly. I'm gonna get my sippy sleep. <clears throat> Check this out. Whoa. <laughs> Whoa. And then I could go over here. That's a lot. You have a lot. And then I could go over here. I know, right? It's <laughs> insane. I don't have any furniture, but you know. Isn't it so nice? <laughs> Actually having space. <laughs> I can fucking do a cartwheel and it doesn't have a goddamn do it, fan. Coward. In the ceiling, so I can just. Wow. <laughs> I could do a fucking. No, I'm gonna break my shit. I know it. <laughs> anyway. Good morning, Miss Laudia. Morning. Morning, Miss Laudia. anyone's supposed to be nervous. Come to see the ship show up. For me, they're already docked. <laughs> oh. Ships have already docked, apparently. That's oh, really? <laughs> what? That's, for that's... me. For me. Your future awaits. I can tell you one thing. Big ship. <laughs> big ship. B big, 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 ship. big ship. Big <laughs> ship. I thought that said salad. I don't know why. Are you hungry? It's like, what? All I had to eat today was a bowl of noodles. <laughs> I haven't eaten yet. <laughs> You want to get food before the ships arrive? Uh, maybe later. Apparently they're already here. I heard they were supposed to be arriving in a couple minutes from, uh, Tazim, but... Yeah, Markle says they're already here, so... Uh, Some people see them. Lost it. Yeah. I think Weird. only Markle sees them. Well, I know that the, uh, the barons are supposed to show up here and greet them as they show up, so if they're not here, then... <clears throat> Neither are the boats. Also... Shriek. Mm-hmm. Where the hell did you get that? <laughs> Looks like something the nobles would wear. Well, <laughs> you'd be right, Lord Sharik. And when did that happen? Yesterday. You sound so doubtful. No, because he knows where I'm from, and he, he knows how stupid you. that is. Right? <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> uh, 
I don't think it's stupid. It's been a long time coming, honestly. Are we sitting here? I mean, I've been sitting here. Maybe for a little bit. A little bit all. Careful. Children stood oh, right no. to the <laughs> Very nice. <clears throat> <clears throat> Apparently, it's a bunch of slave ships coming in. Yeah. Gurbam didn't tell me much more than that. You're, you know what, probably one of the, the safest people here. Player characters, DM announcement, player characters. If for some reason you do not see the ships, please reload the instance. If you do not see the ships, please reload the instance. Thank you. It's time to go. Oh boy. Where are the ships supposed to be? They're all here now. Do 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 Everyone loading back in at the same time is going to be terrible. Anyway, that, that's a sink issue. That one's almost <laughs> under. Still no ships. All the way up. Uh, the ship should be at the dock. Nope. <laughs> Do you see him? Okay, then yeah, I gotta reload. I already did. No ships for me. <laughs> They're not here. La 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 la. No ships.
Saviors aren't there. Oh. Oh. Seen ships. Yeah, I can see them. Okay. Can you? Nope. I see jack shit. <laughs> um, I, I, are you, are you, are you, are you, are you, if you go group I, and then I rejoined. I rejoined. Did you do it through the group thing, or did you go back to your home world and then? Yes. Okay. I went back to home and then I rejoined. No, no, no. Do um, go group. And then, um, instance, and okay. then rejoin instance. That's what worked for me. I went back to my home and it didn't work for me. Okay, let me try it with a rejoin. <clears throat> mm -hmm. But I have business with you today. Yeah. I've done that twice and it didn't work. Mm. Figure it out. Bugger. I guess I'm not allowed to see the ships. Well, they're here. They're fucking huge. Hey, you should grab the anchor from the ship. <laughs> wow, it's almost like deja vu. So, like, are there people on these boats that I also can't see? Or are they, you know, not seen yet? They're not seen yet. <clears throat> I think there might be one or two on the dock, maybe. Okay. All right. As long as I'm still seeing the... As long as it means I'm not unable to see the people, it's fine. Yeah, no, there's no one there yet. The, the ships are there, but the people are not. If there's no one on them, we can just take them. Sail right back to Corcatus. No one would ever know. Do you see them now? I do, yes. Good. Well, now what? I'm scared. We I guess wait. we sit. Yep. I'm gonna sit right there. Yep, I'll join you once I've picked my music. See the cool big boats, but I can't. Player characters. Player characters. <laughs> Unfortunately, at this time, I ask that you go ahead and join my new instance. Bruh. Go to your location that you are at now once you join the map and await for your cards to be put back up. We'll make this as quick and painless as possible. <laughs> go ahead and request on me at this time, please. Or request on the group instance. I, I apologize. Group instance. I only see one. Oh no! There's <gasps> another one! Come Jeez. to me, my gods. Kibbiti and Frankiti! Kibbiti and Frankiti! Kill the Imperials! Kibbiti and Frankiti! Kibbiti and Frankiti! 
Goodbye. I'd like to see you try. Okay, there it is. I don't see it. W group. I don't see it. <laughs> I don't see it. I don't see it. Oh, Um, oh, there we go. I had a nose bleed. In the group. Yep. I'm in the group. I only see the one, and I'm in it. Only in one instance. I might request off uh, someone who already is there. If that works. Oh, there we go. Shit, which one is it? Oh, this one. The one I'm not in, obviously. The one that doesn't say you are- Yeah, okay, <laughs> alright, okay, I get it. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking d- Yeah, I know. Look, I'm tired, all right? Leave me alone. Leave me alone. It could fun. be it could be somebody with really mm. shit internet is the problem. Drop. Well, now that I know that I'll just I make sure that I get it. Um, excuse you, I'm a bad drow. I'm bad at being a drow. Oh, she's bad. Why is she ships? I don't see ships. I don't see the ships either. <laughs> they're not gonna they're be not here, here yet. I don't see them either. I, I don't okay, so I don't think you're coming dude. <laughs> no ship shit, no ship. Okay. No the ships. <laughs> Oh, the bear! Oh, damn! All right, thank you. There it goes. Floating barrel. Oh, now it's gone. I win. That I was win. Awesome. No, I right. can't upgrade you know, it. But you know what? Mine is fast about that bell. Oh, oh. Oh, oh my god! I'm taking out. I'm taking out. I'm taking out. I'm taking out. Finally, give me that. Yeah, give me that. Finally. Yeah. What are you? What are you doing to me? Lord. What are you, what are you doing? <laughs> I finally got to see the kiss, and then I was told- Now kiss. <laughs> so I don't know if they're going to- Oh my god. <laughs> I have to clear my cash and come run on back in. There's- I guess. Third time rejoining that Shut the fuck up, you. So. Jesus Christ. Oh my god. Oh. Sorry, we just don't- See, Imperials are shit. They break everything. What is happening? Yeah, we will yeah fuck the Imperials. I hate these losers. I'm about to go make a salad. I really- I want to fucking eat a salad right now so bad. <laughs> the Imperial was just like- Holy oh, shit. Go eat, girl, go I'm eat. serious, I will have a bowl of salad sitting right here. I don't yeah. give a fuck. I've eaten so many things. <laughs> well, if it isn't service. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> oh, hello, matron. <laughs> I, I, I've done the same thing before. <laughs> Salad I love eating in the middle of RP, especially the big talks. It's like a fucking movie. <laughs> if you see my hands like this, it's a fucking nine out of ten times I am chowing the fuck down on some shit. I need I need to buy more I snacks. Food. I need to buy more snacks that I can eat during RP, so I, I'm not fucking. Hungry. I want to get most of the time I don't eat like until very bread late. and cheese and like uh, like dried oh, meats and stuff like grapes. that that would like fit this this scenario. And then, like, you know? Dude, fuck yeah. <clears throat> we used to do that for tabletop D&D. Nice. Like, when we'd all get together before COVID. <clears throat> Hell it was yeah. so fun. We had, like, a gala, and someone brought, like, Peking duck, if you've never had that. Mm -hmm. It's a Chinese dish. Mm -hmm. So good. It was fucking amazing. And they had music, and they had a fog machine, or a mist, or whatever it's called. It was cold, and it didn't make my lungs hurt, so I think it was a mist. It was fucking awesome! It was just a big jewel. Now I'm hungry, but I don't 
Oh, the ships aren't here yet. I'm gonna no, no, the ships are not here. to the bathroom. They gotta replay the animation. JK. Yeah, go Shishi. Well, I'm my Shishi should girl. actually be getting uh, a bowl of salad, but I feel guilty oh. saying I'm going to oh. make food. Go make food. That's <laughs> fine. <laughs> So, from here yeah, on out, we're going to be calling Falcon wow. and going to the bathroom and making a salad, right? Ugh. Sorry? Yeah. Do you have... Yes. Do you have shrooms? <laughs> no, no, officer. Sure. Hold on, guys. I'm going to go make a salad. <laughs> that one, Inquisitor. Right there. <laughs> the half I've got, half I've got you, bro. Throw it again, throw it again, throw it again. Oh, yeah. <laughs> nice. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, so we're gonna like jump them as soon as they show up, right? Or we're just gonna fucking. Yeah, we can handle all 800 that takes for all those ships. Uh -huh. yeah. It's about sending a message. Yep. 800 per ship. Everything burns. I'll take another. I'll kill like. 400, and then you kill the other 400, okay? When he suddenly just appears. Exactly. The rest of us are not about coin. You can take 300. It's that fucking, it's that Im I mean, I've been playing a lot of Ultra Kill. I it's that image of fucking, of, of fucking Goku and Vegeta yeah, standing next to each other. You get all the ones on the left, I'll get um, all the ones on the right. <laughs> it's just, it's just Screw you, I'll take 501! <laughs> oh my god, Marin Ballin! The Inquisitors keep kicking me in the dick. Oh god, fucking... <laughs> What? They keep shooting me. <laughs> Why? Why do they keep, do they keep <laughs> night killering me in the dick? Yeah, there you go. Hello, Drow. <laughs> they keep oh killing God. me in the dick. <laughs> <laughs> oh fucking lord! How scary is this going to be? We don't even have 800 NPCs. Anything in the spawn room is, is to go on. I, I've seen some I've seen scary stuff. I know that the We don't even have that many Yeah, we don't even have 800 NPCs. This will be fine. Just shimmy our way through their armor and then we'll put them down. Fuck's sake. Ow. Ow. Stop that. Noises. Loud noises. Like noises. <laughs> just imagine going up to somebody I, I with like a think, dagger or something, and you, you just start going. Stop. stop. And he just and he just starts going. Stop, 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 it. stop it. No, stop it. Stop. That stop hurts. It. Stop. Stop it. Stop it. You better do it. <laughs> My brain matter. Better do it. <laughs> it's, it's fucking um. Oh my god, stop. I'm about to Franz Ferdinand this Inquisitor, I swear to god. Stop it. Okay. Are you ready? <laughs> Just run up. <laughs> <laughs> the shot heard around the world. <laughs> Just, Just fuck you. Oh, okay, here we go. Uh, location? Shit, fuck. Alright, give me a moment. I gotta fucking... Places, people. Yeah, I think it's time for you to... No. If I saw the ships, I would be around... Tell us if the ships are arriving. They're not here yet. The ships are re-arriving. Look at all these people with fucking invis toggles. How fancy. I know, right? I gotta switch avatars. Same. Oh, it's fine. We'll just... No. No. <laughs> Just put you on the stretch rack. Thank you guys for the subs. It's very kind of you. <clears throat> Do any of you see the, the boats? Uh, not yet. They're not arriving yet. Oh, well, they're on their way, I guess. From, from my position, from my position, just gonna lead Haz <laughs> Lee Hazi Oswald. The dude who JFK is... <laughs> yeah. As these guys are coming up, just bang! Oh god. <clears throat> Player characters, your cards are up. Player characters, your cards are up.
Are you going to be able to have any sort of handle on this, or is it out of your hands? I'm to burn when they get here. I've done my part in burning books. I have to do with the forge <coughs> and any sort of evidence that they would have. When they're here, I'm going to be taken to the clinic. So, there's no point. Based on the letters that they got sent. Those of you that are at the Nautis docks will see some flashes coming from the lighthouse signaling incoming ships. Those of you who have been here long enough or have a nautical understanding knows that they're about 10 minutes out. Wait. You're the Smith's Apprentice, right? Mm hmm. You dress up nice. Thank you. Morning, Lorelai. Is there, is there something going on? Apparently, we're getting some visitors. Ships are coming. Good morning. Okay, cool. I'm all right. How are you? Very good. Let's be careful. Just remember my deeds. I bowed so you didn't have to. So no one would have to. Putting the wagon before the horse, aren't you? My fate is sealed, and if I run, then everyone will be under suspicion that I've tried to clear. So I cannot run. How are they gonna get past the blockade? Next step is for the rest of you to not get caught or do anything that would get you exposed. Depends on who steps off that ship, they I suppose. They have nothing on you. They have nothing. And if they say they do, they're wanting a reaction. If certain people show up, it won't matter if they have anything. I know. An Inquisitor will be showing up. I've been informed of that much. Did you get a name? High Inquisitor. That's all I was told. Big man himself. There are several High Inquisitors. Mm. Several. Just means an administrative position above Arch Lecter, if I'm not mistaken. Arch Lecter's are more so. Parish owners, they own the various parishes around so Sunmore. And of course, keep the word and all the word bearers. This individual, I don't think any of us have seen, and I don't think it'll matter. Everyone is standing here waiting for the Imperial ships to arrive. <clears throat> Feels a tenseness in the air around them. Even if it's not from themselves, it's easy to discern that some pe people who are waiting do so with bated breath. There is a feeling largely of discomfort. Sort of like the calm before the storm. The whipping of winds and the rains of gales seemingly not too very far off. You hear shouting coming from the sentries of the castle itself, identifying ships on the horizon. It is only a matter of time. Surely do me a favor and such an avatar. Oh. 
party would have would be up here. Well, any last minute prep, I suppose. Mm. Yep, can't get any more ready than this. I'm gonna pick a spot and wait. Where should we sit? Same spot. Probably. Well, then we just go and bang on the door and yell at it. Gladio feels her, say, her fate is sealed. <clears throat> Can you blame her? No. Apparently she's done some actions that have put her in the direct line of fire rather than us, though. By her own choice, I assume. Definitely. I certainly didn't put her up to it. Hmm. Hey, Scrungles. I wonder. Oh. <gasps> oh, <how's it> <laughs> Hello, child. Be better. I'm doing alright. We did the morning, all that, this and that. Wanted to tell you. Oh, you here we go. Oh. Oh, right. yeah. the summer I can't wait until <clears throat> it turns out that Scrungles is a it's Imperial sympathizer. After all, whatever this is, spectacle. And the highest, the sun reaches the highest point in the sky. I have a duel. <laughs> uh, some asshole knight, Sir Hartford. He claimed, I think, of House Hartford. I don't know. Sir, boy, Sir Hart. I don't know. As in, like, did Lady Hartford have some servants? I have, <laughs> I have no <laughs> idea. <laughs> he wasn't blonde, <laughs> so. <laughs> that I don't make know. Any I, it doesn't make any sense. I know. I know. Trust me. I know. Okay. So you're gonna beat some sense. That's today. I. Okay. I should hope so. Right. So that'll be fun. You know, we don't get too many of those. Tang. Right. Y'all got like. You could cheer me on. You wanna help me with an escape plan? Gonna be. Ah, in the flower field. Just out there. Not really. I'm kind of locked in here. No, I'm... Mm. Help with a what? Bring up, bring I need your skills of your profession, not of the get-the-fuck-out-of-town variety. Go on. I need to finish something to help somebody else move. Has anybody told you it's a really nice shirt today? Yeah, Thank you. That's what are you up to today, besides uh, vacationing. It has buttons. Was it? I mean, it's kind of like loops. Oh. Loops buttons. It, it it does up, basically. I mean, a button is one half of a loop. I, mean, yeah, I don't have any of those. Clearly. Do you need this done right now, Tang? The ships are going to arrive soon. Oh god. I'm aware. What? Could I... Do I sound like shit? It doesn't need to be done right now. No, I just you've got an animal that's just cr like inside of you. Crumple on my underneath your arm. Animorph. <laughs> you have a hand that is also a cat. You want to bite my just, salad? I was just wanting no, to make you things. aware of it because you are one of two people that are the hardest to get a hold of inside of this city. Well, and after um, that, probably yeah. going to be even harder. When this is all wrapped up, then yeah, I'll come find you. We'll see you in a bit, eh? Thank you. Making a new set of legs, it's not easy. Yeah, of course. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, how's it going? Good luck. Uh, well, could be better. Well, I was gonna go check. Oh, <clears throat> well, I won't stop you. Nice 
nice lounge chair. Got the snack. Morning. It is done, and I return. Oh, already? Oh. Only twenty percent. We we you know you barely had time to uh, settle in. I know I was hitting you again, my dear friend. There is never time to settle in. Oh, if you wish to see so the work, yes, it is. You will find it. I'm just wondering about supply. I'm actually getting you know resources and things like that. I don't know. <laughs> just keep thinking about it. Of course, no, 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 I'm just with the blockade. I don't know if I told you, Shig, I found something cool at Wainwrights I was going to show you yesterday. Oh, yeah? Or not, the day before. A few days ago, really. I uh, had one of the uh, red knife daggers for sale. Huh. <laughs> <clears throat> That's a nice bit of memorabilia, I suppose. Not great in the wrong hands. Once everything gets sorted out, I guess. Really not. You make all the bad thoughts. Some guy saw me with. But I was thinking about. Oh, yeah. Some guy saw me with it and warned me that they were coming to no. So I uh, handed it off to him. Smart. Rather him have that on his person when they show up than me. Smart, I'd say. Put the target on someone else's back. Exactly. They're not going to be too happy if uh, someone who's not a thief then has one of those knives. Standing here waiting. You both survey the scene in front of you. Knowing that when the Imperium arrives, they will be taking control of the docks, as they usually do. <clears throat> more than likely, it will be more organized than it was before, but it still presents its own... ...problems. Kyler, your eyes flick off to the right, and you see... Claudia sitting on one of the towers, despondent, almost just staring out into the water. And as you, Sarah, look up at Kyler and follow where his eyes are, you too see the noble woman sitting there by herself, just staring out to the water. She seems to have a great fear for the arrival of these ships, more so than most others. You wonder what fate will await her. Now that an Inquisitor and his retinue are soon to arrive. Scrungles, when the big scary red ships get to you, we need to stay off the docks, okay? No. I think there's something we're hiding in town. Good. Shit. Wow. I really need to send my heights to her, but I guess I can wait. They're in town. Wow. You can probably find them at their shop. How long ago did the okay. lighthouse go off? A uh, couple of minutes. <clears throat> Who the fuck is that? Ow. Is that your girlfriend? Ow. That's Scringles. Boyfriend? Ow. <laughs> Scrambles. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfucker. <laughs> I'm gonna kill this cat, I swear. Don't get it mixed up for this one. <laughs> <clears throat> get him, Scrungles. There can only be one. <laughs> That's the cat that just pissed on my boot. No, it's not. You fucking touch my cat, I'll kill you. Baby scrungles getting impersonated. <laughs> Mimicry is the best form of flattery, apparently. I don't think so. No? 
no. <clears throat> I think it's stupid. Yeah, it pisses me off too. You don't touch it. <laughs> oh, Mark. Hello. Would watch from the balcony. We could. Technically, we're not supposed to be up there. Oh, you mean that one over there? Wall's too high. You'd sit on it. Yeah, but it's scary. I don't want to fall. I need to get you like one of those like harnesses that has the rope attached to it. <laughs> Fuck you. I could walk. You can wear one too, and we can hold <clears throat> each other's. <laughs> That's a funny visual. Fun. You both have one connected, and when you s I swing one of you, and you both go flying up. Great way to climb something. Can you... Th throw me into the fucking sun? <gasps> no, throw me up there. What the fuck are you looking at? <laughs> what do you point? <gasps> at Ladia? Please don't hurt him. It's my Bye. child. My one baby. <laughs> B for Papa's. Well, the closer... It's a Papa's body. B for Papa's. The closer Lavia gets, the easier it'll be to find. Give me a S. Wait a minute, I think I still have it. Do I have it here? Aha, uh, here we go. You're going to get cat hair all over your clothes. In a way, little detective hat. With a 19, he somehow manages to stay perfectly clean of cat hair. I'm gonna put your hat on you. There you go. Stay out of the sun. Your little detective hat. All right, there you go. <clears throat> Do you feel handsome? Yes. I... Yeah, you're so handsome. Handsome boy. You're so handsome. You're so handsome. I miss my ghost babies. Where are they? Um, well, we have four now, so in every room except this one. Uh, I see. You're gonna be overrun. We just got a new one, but she's sick. Uh, right. I actually Ow. thought I was going to be anxious about it, but I feel very fulfilled. My day is full of taking care of cats. So well, there you go. You're a cat I'm lady. I'm sorry. Why you look so glum? Oh. Oh, wow. <laughs> it was like a perfect scared arch. What just happened? <laughs> oh, it's stuck on its face. I see. <laughs> Why so glum? Hmm? Uh, I've only heard, you know, the best. At of this point in time, now. everyone in town. Oh, boy. We'll hear a ringing of a bell coming from the castle itself and the echoes of soldiers on the battlements. The Imperial fleet has arrived. And here they come. That means we should be able to see them soon. Supposedly. People keep telling me to get away from the docks, but everybody's oh. here and I'd rather not be alone. So my fear of being <coughs> alone is outweighed by the fear of being alone. Stay here with us. I mean, if we... Yeah. Yeah. If we leave, and you if can we come go up us. to that building, they probably won't. Alright. If we go up to the apothecary roof, they probably won't be able to shout at us. We could do that. Go ahead. 
Want to go up there? Careful, you. The crossing over. Are you sure I shouldn't stay with you? No, it's okay. We got a better show from up there anyway. I think things are arriving soon. I'm gonna go, Always I'm gonna thinking go ahead. <clears throat> See about getting a couple of actual like metal tip spheres made, but I know they take quite a bit of resources mm -hmm. that we don't have in town currently. So I'm looking for something that's like oh, got sharpened stick that they can use to learn and All be right. able to maybe stab an orc in the calf. Right. So to have an actual one, even if it's not metal, about the size for a hobbit, <coughs> forty copper each. Oh. Okay. So this bit Give me is some good. ships are arriving. I'm Imperial. Of homosexual variety, so I'm just going to pull up a. Mm, <laughs> again. Absolutely. Three magical. Oh, everyone's getting front row seats. Not often people see Imperial ships arriving in dock. It happened not too long ago, before, but still rare, incredibly. <clears throat> I wonder why they're here. More supplies, bud. Ah, uh, would I be able to put an order for like 10 of them right now? Four silver? Sure. That would get us the two groups of seven, but that gives me a couple extra. Right. And that way I can work on getting the money to give it for the other stuff. Or so. All right. Well, if it's going to be anything like that, I can imagine we won't be able to do yeah, much on the docks. <coughs> it won't be like last time. Oh, it's locked down again. Of course, yeah. It's good to oh. see people are being industrious. The Baron's going to use them to defend the city. So, well, there's the they're basically going to be... Ha! I had a... Not doing too well, sir. Well, oh, if the rubber Baron's yeah, threatening... Yeah. Who else does he have to turn to? Certainly exactly. not the Sardale or mercenaries. Um, you don't have any um, bad dealings with the Inquisition in the past, do you? No. Lucky you. I fought Imperials, but that's because I was neutral on the battlefield and I was mistaken for an enemy when I passed through the countryside. I'm not a direct enemy. I just fought for my survival in the past. But the Inquisitors the never the met one, process. never intend to. It's going to be an interesting day for you today. But I can tell That's so. Enough for me to buy a I saw from. you. Do no, I saw you as beekeeper. <laughs> uh, yeah. I don't think I fucking see it. Do you see them? I saw them, but they are behind the buildings now. I can't see them from there. Amazing. I'll be right back. Goodbye. You do the zoomies. They don't exist if I don't see them. Well, I did see them. I don't see them anymore. Moving forward anyway. Yeah, I mean, we're basically at the same position where we were. This is the last time I could see them. Now, because we changed the instance, I can't fucking see them. <laughs> Do you 
know the sound of a night killer round going through spider silk? Uh-uh. Would you like to? A few minutes. Yeah, I figured. Uh, we're right uh, here, and then he turned invisible, so there we are. Over there. Hey, Shariq. Uh, yeah. It's a quick, quick question. Can you make spears out of bronze? Uh, yeah. I don't know why you would want a bronze spear, though. Same kind of thing. Because I can get it. Well, if you're that desperate, Still yeah. Still upgrade over just a pointy wooden stick. Yeah, we can do that. Oh, it's... It's an option, so I just want to make sure it was something you'd be able to do. It is. It's just a little uh, soft, that's all. <clears throat> at this point, I'm looking at outfitting a bunch of people with pointy sticks and like maybe two possibly brown spheres, because I can't find iron yet. Yeah, if you can get us the resources. Wondering something is better than nothing. I got a bunch of halves slash pointy sticks ordered already. Very good. And then, yeah, Marcus has some bronze. Wait, thank you. So there, I'll leave you alone. Mm -hmm. Fucking son of a fucking stupid ass goddamn fucking rare gunshot gotcha friends. <laughs> this is fun. Ships on the dock here, or are they just on the way? I think they're on their way. I can actually see them now. Tick, 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 